Hey guys, PsychicHD here again with another video, and today I have my full review of the ZipBuds Juiced in-ear earphones for your mobile devices. Now before I start this video, I would like to thank Ali for sending these out to me free for reviewing purposes from ZipBuds, and without any further ado, let's get straight on into the video review. Now I really like ZipBuds as a company, because I'm a fan of good design, and I know it when I see it. I like the fact that these earphones actually incorporate a zipper, which is why the company is actually called ZipBuds because all of their earphones and headphones actually incorporate a zipper as the cable. Now, the main motive behind doing something like this is actually to avoid tangles when storing the earphones, but I think that it also makes for a really nice aesthetic when actually having these earphones on you. I think they look really nice and overall have a really nice top premium quality feel to them, something that you may actually expect from a more expensive pair of earphones. Now that being said, uh, these of course are not cheap, they come around the $20 price tag, uh, and for someone looking for a pair of earphones as an upgrade from your main, uh, like the earphones that came with your phone or mobile device, I think that this is a pretty good option. Now they come in a bunch of colors and the version that I have here is actually the lime green and black which I think looks really nice because I am a pretty big fan of the green and black. But one of the things that disappointed me was that the cable isn't actually a zipper all the way through and is only a zipper till um, the splitter, where beyond that it actually does split out into or rather join into a braided cable which is a single cable and then leads down to the 3.5mm gold plated jack. Now, while I wish this was like a right angle jack connector, it is straight, but it doesn't seem like it's going to fray anytime soon. Now, one of the things that is pretty interesting about these earphones is that they don't actually fit all the way straight. Like, for example, if you were to put them in like a traditional pair of earphones with the wire hanging down from the front, you actually wouldn't be able to hear anything because they won't fit into your ear and transfer the sound. You actually have to put them around your ear, uh, which is why the top of the cable is also braided um, so that it doesn't irritate the skin behind your ear at all. And overall, I think they provide a really nice snug fit, which will actually probably not fall out even if you're jogging or running around with these. Now, speaking about the fit, they actually do come with a few different styles and sizes of ear tips from small, medium, and large. I personally use the small ones, but I think the medium ones are probably going to be an overall best fit for everyone. Now, the sound quality on these earphones is actually not bad for the price point. The bass is not too um, overpowering, which in some cases could be useful. But for someone like me who likes bass, I think that these earphones are probably not the best for you. The mids of course are pretty nice, they are not overpowering again, uh, but I think they could be a little bit better. And the highs aren't as crisp as I would like them to be, but for the price point honestly, I think that they do sound overall pretty well. Uh, I don't really think they're going to be, you're not going to notice any sort of differentiation between the instruments, but for again for the price point, and honestly I cannot stress this enough, I think that overall these do sound pretty good. Now anyway guys, that does about conclude this video. If you enjoyed it, it would be really awesome if you guys could leave it a like rating. And for more videos like these as well as other unboxings, reviews, tutorials, and much much more, please do remember to subscribe. Anyway guys, thank you very much for watching, and as always, I will catch you all in the next video. Peace.